Hi friend, this is Mandeep and you are watching High Technology TV. In this video, we are going to discuss about Google Cloud Associate Cloud Engineer Certification Exam. So, here we will discuss about that what this certification is about and what are the topics that are included in this exam and how to register for this exam how to prepare for this exam and where to schedule your exam so right now we are at cloud.google.com slash certification slash cloud hyphen engineer and here you know that this exam is for the engineer who deploys application who monitor op operations manages our enterprise solutions and who set up a cloud solution environment, configure the cloud solution, which includes our virtual machine, network, Kubernetes, everything is we have to do. Security, billing, everything we have to do. So here you guys are able to see a button here that is register. So click on that. Here these are the language in which our exam is supported. So here let me click on the English and it will open the link webassessor.com slash Google Cloud. So here first of all you have to create an account. If you guys do not have an account you have to create an account and then you have to pay the registration fee of your exam and then you have to schedule. So I'm not going to show you guys that how to schedule and uh, all that thing but from here you can create an account and then you can schedule your exam back to our this tab and here the exam is length is for two hours and this is the registration fee these are the languages that are supported and exam format is multiple choice question we have a question there and we have multiple answers and we have to select the right answer from there prerequisite is none recommended experience is six month plus hands-on experience with gcp and these are the training guides that is provided by quick lab so i can tell you about that also here you can do the hands-on practice on gcp free tire that is free google will provide us 300 dollar of free credit for 12 months and we can do the hands-on on gcp with that and also when you have done your hands-on then you can practice your exam here here google will provide approximate 30 question and that are almost related with our actual exam so you can check your readiness by taking this exam so now on the quick labs so on quick labs you first you have to sign in and that is for free after that you can go to the catalog here on the cloud environment what you have to do is you have to select the google cloud platform and it will list down all the exam and topics that are related to the google cloud platform so like this gcp sensor so click on this and here you guys are able to see that this is a introductory topic and it gives us five steps with four hours of timing and eight credits so credit is nothing but when you sign in on the quick labs it will give us 250 credits so when we are doing any kind of labs here here you can see that hands-on lab so it have like this is free and this is one credit like when we are giving this particular hands-on lab we are taking this hands-on lab then one credit is debited from our 250 free credit so by this way we have to do the hands-on practice on 
our google cloud platform you guys are able to see that i have already also done that this so by this way you can do your practice hands on on quick lab that is also free so we have two things here that is gcp tire free try tire and quick labs we can use both of them third thing is that google cloud document so for that go to the cloud.google.com slash doc and then go to the cloud product here you guys are able to see the product of google cloud platform so like compute engine cloud storage bigquery vision ai so we have to read about these topics very clearly and carefully because the questions are coming from these topic like what we what we have in the product everything is coming from these particular product like from compute engine they can ask about the vms about their type and about the price all that thing like in the big query they can ask about the how you can estimate your charges or what type of data is stored in these so everything is asked in your exam for the vision ai they can ask about what kind of this service is and they are serverless or with server so they can ask about kind of questions so you have to read about these and you have to prepare very carefully one thing one more thing is that i have given so many certification exam and recently i have done the google cloud engineer exam according to me this is the toughest exam that i have faced so you guys need to be read very carefully so let me show you my certification this is my certification that i have done so i get this issued on 16th of december on 13th of december i have given the exam on one of the test center and up i got the result there when when i finished my exam on the test center my exam result is declared there but uh, also give me a message over there that google will review our exam and then it can contact you so after 3 days i got a mail from google cloud that we have verified your exam and we are issuing you the certificate certificate so this is the certificate it is valid for 2 years here you can check also one more thing is that uh, i have uh, when i pass the exam google send me some goodies so okay friend keep watching and don't forget to subscribe my channel hey friend i got a gift from google cloud and that is sent to fedex i got this when i passed my google cloud engineer exam google cloud associate cloud engineer exam so let's check this out that what is inside this i already opened this but i am making this video so you guys can get an overview that what i got okay so this is a cap with the logo of google cloud you can check it and this is a muffler that is also that also have a google cloud logo here and one more thing is there and that are these socks they have google cloud 
written here and google cloud logo here you can check it that they also have a logo here so these are the three things that i got from google cloud uh, on passing my exam of google cloud associate cloud engineer so that is sent from usa directly